breaking welcome to today's news here is the headlines busted angry group attacks wiki reviews what will happen to him in seven days if he doesn't obey their order busted angry group attacks wiki reviews what will happen to him in seven days if he doesn't obey their order to my dear listeners from wherever you're listening from please stay tuned as i read today's news and please do ensure you like subscribe and share the chairman of the Igbo community assembly Apo in Abuja, Osat Osita Dima Patrick Unwoye, has sternly called upon the Minister of the Federal Capital Territory, FCT, ASM Wiki, to issue a public apology for purported derogatory remarks directed towards the Igbo community. The remarks were allegedly made during the demolition of a housing estate owned by Prince Nicholas Okachoko. In a press conference held in Abuja on Wednesday, Unwoye expressed dismay over Wiki's reported statement, questioning why an Igbo individual was granted substantial land in the area. He further alleged that Wiki had boasted of his past actions against Igbo people in Port Harcourt and threatened to replicate them in Abuja. Owe emphasized that such inflammatory comments are detrimental to national cohesion and urged for a swift resolution to prevent further escalation of tensions. He stressed the importance of fostering peace and unity, especially in a diverse country like Nigeria. The Igbo community assembly issued a seven-day ultimatum to Wiki, demanding a public apology to the Igbo people, failing which they threatened to mobilize widespread condemnation and invoke the traditional deities of Igbo land. Furthermore, Uwe highlighted that the demolition of the housing estate allegedly violated a court order, adding another layer of controversy to the situation. He presented evidence in the form of ministerial approvals for the Asoko real estate and copies of the court order that prohibited its demolition. Characterizing Wiki's actions as act of intimidation, hatred, and heavy towards the Igbo community, the group called upon President Bola Ahmed Tinobu to intervene and restrain the FCT minister. They appealed for justice and adherence to the rule of law emphasizing the need for all citizens to be treated fairly and respectfully, regardless of their ethnicity. The incident has steered reactions within the Igbo community, prompting concerns about discrimination and marginalization. 
Many have called for accountability and urged the government to address issues of injustice and inequality to foster national unity and coercion. In conclusion, the call for an apology from Minister Iesom Wiki underscores the importance of respectful dialogue and inclusivity in nation-building effort. It serves as a reminder of the need to uphold the right and dignity of all citizens, irrespective of their ethnic background. The chairman of the Igbo Community Assembly, Apo in Abuja, Osita Dima Patrick Unwoye, has sternly called upon the Minister of the Federal Capital Territory, FCT, ESM Wiki, to issue a public apology for purported derogatory remarks directed towards the Igbo community. The remarks were allegedly made during the demolition of a housing estate owned by Prince Nicholas Owachuku. In a press conference held in Abuja on Wednesday, we expressed dismay over Wiki's reported statement, questioning why an able individual was granted substantial land in the area. We emphasized that such inflammatory comments are detrimental to national coercion and urged for a swift resolution to prevent further escalation of tensions. He stressed the importance of fostering peace and unity, especially in a diverse country like Nigeria. <laughs> 